The High Scope Educational Approach Exploration Through Adult Child Interactions. The constructivist theory of art development is based on a cognitive theory that describes learning as a process that is influenced by children's level of thinking. The high scope approach was developed by Dr. David Weikart in 1962. This method is used in schools worldwide for all ages and abilities. Educators encourage children to become decision makers and problem solvers. Based on the constructivist theories of Piaget, Vygotsky, and Dewey, and many more. Teachers facilitate learning experiences by posing questions and providing a variety of resources and materials. Children construct their own knowledge through exploration and experimentation with the guided support of adults which serve as facilitators. Adult-child interactions provide active learning through hands-on experiences that follow personal interests. High School Educational Research Foundation is a nonprofit organization that sponsors and provides program information. PHA's intellectual development theory consists of implementing constructive processes to develop intellectual and social skills. Vygotsky focuses on the roles of adults and peers where scaffolding can be utilized in children's learning. This process also provides social interactions through group and partner activities. High School curriculum addresses all areas of development while using five dimensions for school readiness. Approaches of learning, language literacy communication, social and emotional development, physical development, health and well-being, arts and sciences. High School curriculum consists of three key components. Planning time, work time, Recall time, also known as plan, do, and review, where children make choices about what they will do, carry out their ideas, and reflect on their activities with adults and peers. Diversity learning. Teachers facilitate a classroom environment filled with opportunities that inspires diversity, skills, and concepts. Teachers provide a variety of activities that promote cognitive, physical, and social growth that is specific to the child's academic level. Teachers develop individual child assessments and involve parents. High school methods aid children and families of diverse backgrounds. High school's developmental indicators and assessments are complying to teaching and early learning standards.